With New Year's Eve on the horizon, high school basketball tournaments are taking place all over Hampton Roads with one of the biggest ones at the Big House on Monticello. I'm Brian Parsons in for Bruce. When the Virginia High School League reclassified all the regions in the state, it meant the end of one of the most popular events on the calendar, the Eastern Region Basketball Tournament at Norfolk Scope. Well, city officials did not want to lose high school basketball, so it created the Scope Holiday Basketball Invitational, an eight-team tournament featuring some of the top teams in the area. The number one seed is Kay Penry, and Coach Mark Hall's team is loaded with Division I talent, the Dolphins, opening up against Lake Taylor. Kay Penry led by 10 at the half, and that's when it pulled away. Chris Clark, the junior, number 15, putting on a show. How's that for extension? And then Clark is going to take it hard to the rack, wearing those pink shoes. Clark throws down the slammer, 14 points for Chris Clark. Cape Henry goes on a big run to close it out. That's Great Bridge transfer Marcus Evans with the pretty lay-in. Cape Henry wins it 68-36, to and Coach Mark Hall likes the experience of playing good teams on a big stage. Yeah, I think it's a great opportunity for you know all the teams that are participating in this. It gets, it's a great holiday venue. You get all the local teams and a couple of private school teams coming together to put on, which is you know what I think one of the, is going to be one of the biggest tournaments of the year. Game two, Heritage from Newport News taking on the Lansdowne Eagles from Virginia Beach. Heritage wearing maroon. Romello Anderson skies for the one-handed dunk, and then at the other end. Pretty ball movement by Lansdowne. Roderick Nicholson going to finish it off with a nice layup. This game, however, would belong to Heritage. Corey White with 17 points and 14 rebounds. Hurricanes win at 55 to 46 and will play Cape Henry tomorrow in the semifinals. In the late game, Coach Darren Sanderlin and his Booker T. Washington Bookers against Norfolk Christian. Bookers wearing black. Stephen Whitney decides to take it to the lane, gets the bank shot to fall. Now, Norfolk Christian has junior guard George Wahi, and he's fun to watch. Nice dribbling and an even nicer move for the finish. Norfolk Christian, though, having trouble keeping up with the Bookers off the miss. Brandon Gaddy's there for the putback. Booker T cleaning up the glass all night long. Bookers roll past Norfolk Christian 66 to 41. Bookers move on to play Maury. The Commodores got past Norcom 70 to 53 behind Mac. Mike Bass Knight's 30 points, so an all-Norfolk semifinal between Booker T and Maury tomorrow night at Scope. 